That answers your question. Well, Next one. Me. I'm sorry, just quickly follow up for a second. Um, I wasn't thinking, I mean, for instance, when, an, when, the, uh, when the bomb blew up in Jerusalem, yeah. excuse me, on the beach, that basically ended the dialogue between the United States and the PLO for the time being. For the, for the time being. Right. Jews roamed through the streets right. and just, you know, threw rocks at, at, at cars, right. ran, totally randomly. Right. I'm not talking about, right. I mean, I understand what you're saying, but still it seems to me that despite, what, despite these outbursts here, that in many cases... There are innocent Arabs, ones who have lived in Israel since 1948, own businesses, vote Likud at times. Um, and to me, to punish them for the action of a terrorist, I think does contradict this. And I think a medium, we don't have to go totally out of control. I mean, I believe that Israel should be protected. I'm not sure whether or not we should give the occupied territories back. I don't know. I'll reserve judgment. But I don't believe that, on the other hand, we should go so far as to just say, well, an Arab blew up this bomb, and an Arab's over there, so I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to beat the... In a certain sense, I think, in a, in a certain sense, I think that you're right. But what is your answer to a frustrated and bitter and frightened people that sees this happening every single week and the government is either incapable or unwilling to take steps. What are they supposed to do? How easy it is for you to sit here in an, you know, an atmosphere of you know, a college, university, a campus and talk about it's not right. I agree with you. Can't you begin to grasp how they feel? Secondly, if I would ever be Prime Minister of Israel, uh, not one Arab would ever be killed because they wouldn't be there. And I would rather move them out and have them live with their own people than kill them every single day. What is more moral? What is more moral? Tell me. Having the army shoot them every single day because they throw rocks and firebombs at uh, soldiers? Is that more moral or is it more moral to have an exchange of populations. We took in 800,000 Sephardic Jews from Arab countries, and now let's finish it by giving them the Arabs from the Jewish country. I think that that is a moral issue and a moral answer, and if you don't think so, it's not enough to say, well, I don't think so. You, you had better give a better answer, because if you tell me, well, I have no, no answer, that is no answer to me and my wife and my children and three and a half million Jews living inside Israel.